Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And here we have a great article from Fierce Wireless, which I will leave it in the description down below. So I want to start off by saying that anything that that has to do with 5G with SA, AT&T and Verizon are going to be behind. So in this case, AT&T dials up 5G SA uplink to carrier aggregation. This is in the lab. And I'll leave an article in the description so you guys can check it out. AT&T is doing this in a lab in Redmond, Washington. And T-Mobile already does this commercially. It's already live on the network. So I'll give that to I'll give credit, you know, where credit is due. And I'll give that credit to T-Mobile. Anything moving forward that has to do with 5G, SA, anything voice, T-Mobile is going to be in the lead at the forefront. T-Mobile is already doing doing all of this outside of the lab. They're doing this on the commercial network. The core has been active since 2020 on low band. Now they're incorporating the mid band. Now they're bringing aggregation. And like I said, the, this uh, uplink aggregation, T-Mobile already has live active on the network. And same with voice over NR, that's already live and active on the network. So anything artic, uh, anything that you see on articles that comes out, uplink, downlink, voice over NR, anything SA related, T-Mobile is already doing that commercially. T-Mobile has been testing in the lab years ago, and they're already deploying this on the network. But good to see that at t is starting this in the lab. I'm sure, like I said in the previous video, Verizon's also testing voice over NR, sli network slicing, all of that in the lab. But the only difference is here, T-Mobile's already doing that commercially. So keep that in mind. Anything you see from Fierce, Live Reading, anything that has to do with SA 5G, T-Mobile's already doing that commercially. Always, always have that thought in your head that you see that uplink, downlink, T-Mobile's already doing that commercially and i know fierce wireless is saying in this article that they believe at&t is the first to do this and no t-mobile already does this commercially so make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel for more like share subscribe follow the social media outlets this is tyrone with tech life see y'all in the next one peace